As well as the things that I said we'd talk about, um, I, I, I come from the procurement school of always give them more than they think they're going to get. Yes, I'm that sort of guy, right? And what we're going to do is we're going to drip feed two or three little skills tips, the sort of thing that we would be teaching our people in WPP. And this is the first one. This is the first one. Something procurement people call conditioning. Commonly heard in typical negotiations. And let's see how many of these you recognize. Are we recognizing this stuff? It's all bullshit. Conditioning is the ability in a negotiation or preparing for a negotiation to get the other side thinking about they're going to have to do something. It's just a matter of how much. Yeah, and all of these little statements uh, are what procurement people call conditioning. And procurement make a science out of this stuff. There are books or chapters of books written about how to condition your opponent um, in a negotiation scenario, okay? My advice to you is, as it always is with our WPP folks we're working with, is be skeptical about what you're hearing. Be very, very skeptical. Um, one of the folks we've worked with over the years, many, many years, is Harvard. We've done a lot of work with the Harvard program in negotiation. Um, they publish a monthly you know, newsletter, whatever. And I, I read an article, it was a kind of academic article about conditioning in negotiation, effectively telling lies in negotiation. Um, and it came to the conclusion, maybe not surprisingly, that everyone tells lies in negotiations all the time. All the time, we all do, not just procurement, by the way. We all tell lies. Usually we, we rationalize it to ourselves, the quite small lies, little ones, um, but we all do. Now, Harvard being Harvard couldn't write an academic paper and call it telling lies in negotiation. It's a bit abrupt, it's a bit Scottish, isn't it, really? So they actually came up with a better term. They called it ethical drift. <laughs> I can just see the headline and campaign next week. Kinnaird says procurement ethically drifts in negotiation. Shock, horror, isn't it? Right, okay. So be skeptical um, in terms of what the other side are telling you and think about conditioning in reverse. Think about this thing of scarcity that Dan was talking. I can't give you a proposal, We're really busy this month. So much new business coming out of our ears, you know, whatever. It's conditioning. These are all conditioning messages.